everyone, this is one dragon Mini one here doing a video request for Dinosaur Soda, looking for Sheila's kids in Beyond the Black Stump. Now, I might not talk much in the video, if I don't then I apologize, but let's just say, during in these videos, I like to put out the fiery logs, because you know, as we all know, fire is bad for the environment. And I might make a few little mess ups. Now, and like the spider just there, you just see. The first koala kid was easy to find, as well as the second one, which is not far from the first. And the second, somewhere in a video, I like to collect golden cogs as well, because I just like to collect things. Something shiny and gold. And we got two nailed down, and we got a few more to go. Well, make that six. <laughs> And as for those thrill lizards, although we all know it's they're sneaky, but recommend if you want to bite them, freeze them first with a frosty ray. So this is another way to the koala kid here with a spinning log. Bang goodbye, bang goodbye, bang goodbye. See with these ice cubes. Those are pretty big ice cubes. Ice cubes. Oops. Um, didn't mean to mix up those words today, I'm just feeling a bit warm in the hot weather. The same reason with the frosty rent switch by accident. Didn't know why I did that. Yet, I'm using a fire elemental boomerang and I hit it on a lock, which I'm surprised it didn't set light. And there's also another shock. An icy rung didn't get melted by the fire or the heat wave by fire. Must be one of those unmeltable ice. We got some more to find. <laughs> now in this bit, I meant to kill every log and freeze the frill lizards while I'm doing that. Best thing about those ranks, they automatically aim at the enemies, but don't automatically aim at the logs. Because though they're not class well, they're probably classed as enemies, but they don't live except for burning you. Which what well, pretty much fire can do. It's pretty obvious. Duh. I'm sure all you remembered the video part from the re video request for um, I'm in Stewie Griffin's five. You know, in this bit to find the bilbies, except this one is going to be get to the kid instead, not the bilby, because I already got the bilby yesterday. Oh, and if you're wondering, the last one's got five lives and all. It's because I cheated. I couldn't be bothered to do all those hard efforts to get all the elemental ranks and such, so, you know, I pretty much cheated. So, now I've got the other kid, now we just need more to find. Destroy every fire log again. I like to put them out. So, off I go. Zapping the frills. Yes, I do that, continue on. Zapping every frill lately. I know I'm mean, but it's better than punching me. It's better them than me. Now, I don't know why I want to get to the golden cog there, but, you know, like I said, I just want to get the cogs because I want to collect them. And I missed for the first time, which I don't know how I did that. Just... And if you hear Peter babbling, then, you know, at least you can hear it slightly. Not as much as I once used the camera to make videos. So onwards to find the kids. Now, the kid is behind this bunch of fire logs. And remember, the hint is listen for their whistles. I know most of the times you hear fire and this is going and such, but if you remember, listen to their whistles and follow the whistle, you'll find them. That's the hint for finding Sheila's kids. There's only two levels, which is no worries and beyond the black stump to find Sheila's kids. So, you know. And yet again, zapping the lizards. I'm so cruel, it's unbelievable. Now we got two more to find. Now this one's gotta be the fun bit. Get to the golden cog with a meat eating plant. But which luckily they don't eat you, they just spit you. So here we go. Whee! I'm flying in the air. And again. These 
plants must be really, really strong. Now, when I realized, I forgot to put out the fire logs before going to the plant and such, so <laughs> that's a big mistake I did. Now I'm just going to defeat the frills. Gotcha. And again. Now, this is sneaking. The frill is always behind that log. <laughs> and that was a funny bit there. Now I got my revenge. Run! And I know where the last one is. I just want to put out that fire log. I'm just being random at times. That's pretty much why I am. Random. So, you know. If people don't like it, then they pretty much bite me. So anyway, I'm onwards going this way. This is where the last one I found. Now, I wanted to get rid of the fire log, not the thrill. And I wasn't thinking straight about the fire bits. Urgh. So I keep hitting... I wanted to hit the log, not the lizard. I tried to bite him. And then I thought, ah, you know, zap it. Who is my worst bit? Look, bang! Free freeze him and zap him, that's just... Yikes. Nasty. Imagine being frosted and then being zapped. I don't want to think about that. Anyways, now I found all eight little kiddly winks. But I must admit that some of the voices for Sheila's kids is a bit retarded if you ask me. No offense, but that's what it sounded. Some of them are okay, like the squeaky one, like, Cheers, Uncle Ty! That, that's okay. But others like, um, I don't know. Oh, that part I was got lost, like, whoops, wrong turn. But anyways, it's near the end of this video. Once you find the kids, she will obviously will give you the t thunder egg. Thanks to little Kiki. Thanks again, Ty. So, anyways, it's near the end, and I hope you enjoy this video request, dinosaur soda. And you know, I wish you luck for beating the game and such. Hope you have a wonderful day and other days ahead of you.